Today we have what looks to be another too good to be true dress business. Quite a few of you have sent me this brand in particular, so I'm guessing they are bombarding you with ads. Particularly for this pearl dress, which is very beautiful. Comes in a bunch of different colors. It honestly looks really beautiful and like it will be very flattering on a bunch of different body types. And it's $40, which is not bad price wise. So let's check it out. Okay, the brand is called Amari Angel. So let's investigate their Instagram first. Of course, the infamous pearl dress is right on top in a pinned post. Okay, 14,000 likes likes, but they are running it as an ad. 204,000 followers. And it looks like most of their posts have likes turned off. Not a ton to go off of in the comment section. Okay, here's some real comments. Yeah, I mean, I'm not seeing any really concerning comments that are like, where's my order? <laughs> so that's a good sign, I guess. Engagement is a little suspicious. The suspicious brands always have the same bios too, with like the emojis. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, we're gonna try it though. Okay, time to check out the website. Here it is. Um, it's pretty basic, I would say. They have some cool stuff though, aside from just the pearl dress. So we have no idea where this brand is from. <laughs> Will my credit card information get stolen? Will my order ever show up? Oh, that Valentine's dress is fun. Ooh, this one. That's cute. We got three size choices. I love that. Just go with the biggest one and hope for the best, okay? <laughs> so let's get one of those. It's giving dresses kind of fun. This like satin corset top and then the ruched bottom. Yeah, that could be cute. Oh, rude. Okay, maybe not. Okay, we've got some like actual prom dresses here. This one's kind of cool. With these sparkly roses on it. That's on the more expensive side, $80. The question is, as is with most of these websites, are these actually their pictures? <laughs> they have a mix of just these ones taken on a plain wall. And the girl has the same necklace on it, basically all the pictures. And then we've got the same girl in front of this like Christmas tree. So either they took all of these photos from the same place or they actually took all these photos. I'm not gonna lie. I'm really scared about the sizing. So I'm gonna check out their plus size section. Wow, that's, that's it. <laughs> Great. Oh, this romper's only 10 bucks. Well, let's throw one of those in. Okay, one, two, and three X is their plus size section. Look at this with the roses on the back. That's kind of cool. I think we should get it. Wait, mystery bundles. Should we get one? Okay, we can do three, five, or seven items. Let's go five. 50 bucks for five items. That's pretty good. Okay, I think we've got a good mix of very cheap, a little bit expensive, <laughs> a mystery box. Uh, this should be fun. All right, I'm gonna check out and then I will see you guys in a couple weeks. Well, a couple seconds for you guys, but a couple weeks for me. <laughs> all right, it's a couple weeks later and gang's all here. At least I hope so. We've been running into a lot of issues during videos where they send like a partial order and then never send the rest. So hopefully this is everything. It looks like a kind of a lot of dresses. <laughs> we got a free scrunchie. That's nice, I guess. It doesn't match any of the dresses, but I mean, they're feeling flimsy, but to be fair, a lot of the dresses I got are like mini dresses, so. <laughs> okay, I'm assuming this is our mystery bag. It's gonna be interesting, guys, for good or for bad. <laughs> Starting off with our cheapest clothing item, our $10 romper. This is a 2XL? I mean, I hope it fits. <laughs> it's looking a little small for a 2XL, but um, let's try it on. Okay, so the design of this romper is primarily elastics everywhere. Realistically, this could fit like a size medium to probably a size two or three XL. Honestly, it's kind of a brilliant design in that sense that it could fit so many sizes. I kind of like it. I'm not gonna lie. It's actually a pretty good length. I like that it gives the illusion of being a little like summer dress, but it's shorts. So you get the functionality there. We're off to, hello, what was that? You wanna go out of here? You're done with this haul? Okay, Leo's not impressed, but I am. Yeah, for 10 bucks. I'm interested to see how the products that they're charging $50 for compare, but. Okay, the next one, because I'm going least to most expensive, the famous pearl dress. Oh, ho, ho, it's looking like the pictures. This was $44. Pretty much everything is on sale on the website right now. Maybe it always is. Yeah, let's see how this one looks. Okay, here is our pearl dress. It's little. Like I accidentally sized up in the romper. I probably should have accidentally sized up in everything <laughs> from this haul. It's cute though. Like I like the texture of it. I feel like yeah, ruche of it is very flattering. The pearls are actually nice. These tiny little straps scare me a little bit because it's literally just the mesh like rolled up a little bit and sewn so that's 
<laughs> potentially dangerous, but yeah, I would say it's honestly more realistic to the Instagram than I thought it would be. It's given a little waist snatch, nothing too crazy, but I wish I would have gone like one more size up, but it's cute. Is it $44 cute? Maybe. Okay, next dress, the Bonita dress. Okay, this one is kind of similar vibes. $48 though. Do you or do you not feel bonita? I don't feel that bonita. <laughs> I don't know. I just don't like the slit situation. It's not, it's just weird. Um, the cups are also <laughs> not nearly as big as they should be for me. And not my favorite. Not bad. On somebody else, I feel like this would actually be a super cute dress. We're also nearing that line. Like our dresses from now on are over $50. And while these were under $50, I was like, okay, not bad, not bad. But unless we see some decent quality upgrades in these next ones, it's a little iffy for me, but yeah, here's the Bonita dress. I really like the style, the little ruffles on top. Once again, the ruche is super cute. I don't know. I just don't think this one's made for me. <laughs> but let's see if the bad gal dress is. It's $50. Okay, this one might be my favorite so far. It's actually a good length. The top fits great. The back has like a cute little crisscross tie detail. I like this. This is a good, kind of like a prom or like a fancy event. Pretty affordable option. For 50 bucks, this really isn't bad. And I really like the flowery sequin detail. Now this one's cute. This is going better than I imagined it would be, to be honest. I'm actually pretty excited for the next one. I think it will also be fun, but I don't know guys, as long as they stay on sale for these prices, <laughs> it's pretty decent. Also, um, I was like watching back my shopping footage and I realized this brand follows me on Instagram, which is kind of weird. They've never reached reached out or anything though. This is not partnership with them by any means. So far, so good. Amari Angel. Amari Angels. <laughs> All right, the next one is $64. And it's the draped in roses dress. And it looks exactly like the name says. Oh my gosh, no, I really like this one. The fabric's nice. It's like a little bit thicker of a fabric. This neckline with the halter is super fun. Once again, the length is good. You can wear heels with it. Still plenty long. Okay, I need. A a girl on The Bachelor to wear this dress. Cause imagine it, she walks up and meets The Bachelor and she's like, hi, my name's Kate. And he's like, wow, so good to meet you. And then she says, I'll see you inside. And then she turns around to reveal the cute little roses on the back. <laughs> I'm kind of obsessed with this dress. Not bad. Once again, I hope the prices stay this low, but this is fun. This is probably gonna be the winner for me cause <laughs> I love it. Lee, look how cute it is super duper doesn't care. Okay, well, we've got one more, more expensive than this. And this fabric looks fun. Is this the most expensive? Oh, I got it backwards. The light pink was actually the most expensive. I liked it better when I thought it was 50, <laughs> but this is actually the bad gal, $50 one. So sorry. Okay, here we go. This is cute. Imagine this back when I had my blonde and pink hair, this would be fire. Okay, 50 bucks. Pretty cute, if you ask me. I would say out of all the mini dresses, this one is definitely my favorite. We've got that ruche. I think the neckline is just so cute and flattering. And this sparkly pink fabric. I really like this one. Quality wise, it's like, it's borderline not worth $50, but it's still fun. Most of these tags are a different brand. We've got Lush BJ. <laughs> what? <laughs> Privy, Privy, Love Some, and Symphony. So really this place is just basically a boutique of a bunch of different brands, but yeah, so far I'm not mad. Like I don't feel lied to with any of these dresses. They definitely look how they were promised. I wouldn't say they're like a screaming deal, but you know, it could be a screaming deal. Our mystery bag that's coming up. Okay, first item is, what the heck is this? Oh, it's a little dress. Interesting. Wait, that one's actually really cute with the cherries. It's like a meshy fabric. See, that's the thing with these is like, if you get one thing that you really liked, I don't know, it's still not quite worth it. Like $50 for one dress you like. Let's keep going, let's keep going. Oh, cute again. Okay, no, there's two, at least two that I like. Um, We also have plain black top, not bad. Last fit. What? Is it a set? So yeah, a little Thai crop top. And I'm guessing that's a skirt. This is such cheap fabric, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so the brown things I'd probably never wear, but the black, okay, probably not the black top either, but the cherry dresses, those are cute. I, I don't know if it was worth $50 to get both of these, but I don't know. That's the thing with mystery boxes is it's just, you pay for the fun of the mystery sometimes. I'll try on the cherry dresses for you. All right, cherry 
dress number one. There's not a lot to it, but I feel like layered and accessorized the right way. It could be cute. I don't know, like a leather jacket, some fun boots. It's just kind of like Y2K fun. All right, cherry dress number two. Low key might be my favorite dress out of the entire haul. <laughs> it's just so comfy. The length's good. You got the little like embroidered cherry. It's cute, not bad. I feel like liking half the things in the package is a win in a way, because <laughs> it could have all sucked. All right, well, final thoughts for this brand. I'm definitely keeping a few of the dresses and then I'll probably give the rest of them away to you. But overall, fairly realistic, somewhat worth the price. I'd say this was a win though. As always, if you ever see any other too good to be true brands or just brands that you find interesting, make sure to tag me in them or send them to me. Really, this is like a hack because you know I'm gonna give a lot of it away. <laughs> so if you see something you like, send it my way. Make sure to check out my other Instagram dress reviews if you haven't binge watched those yet. And we'll see you in the next video.